Run, bank, 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 bank. Oh my gosh, I do not know if I'm gonna make this. You've got it, you've got it, you've got it, you've got it. You make it, you make it, you make it. Just run, just run, you've got it, you've got it. You make it. The skeleton boost, the skeleton boost! Yes! Yes! Oh my god! Yes! Yes! When you think about any hermits in the event, you would think of people like False, Green, Scar, Impulse recently. But one of them is probably one of the underrated ones in the group who participated in MC Championship. And that this person is actually good in games and some skills, earning the nickname of Gemini Slay. This is Gemini Tay. Gem's background before the event and during the event is similar to ones who are in the event in the first place, being involved in SMPs such as Empires and Hermitcraft, the two key SMPs that are often shown in the MCC space. She is a builder with all other skills in her disposal, from PvP and other necessary skills to excel in the event. She has a lovely dog called Vinny and she lives in New Finland, Canada relatively close to the event server's location, which is why she really dislikes holding the wall with a passion. She started her time in MCC in MCC 17, with two of her server mates, Jimmy and Fib, as well as Quick, and they somehow are in shorts. Yeah, uh, I, I think she persuaded them to do it, oh yeah. Her last event was pretty rough in some games, but one of her plays that eventually is her signature when people think about her is her last second sense of time finish in her first event. Oh, oh no! no! Where's the exit? No, no, left, behind you, behind you, left, 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 up, 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 up. Please! I did it! Yes! Okay, thank god. Oh my god, that was horrible! Oh my gosh. I should oh, not have went for that key. My markers are so important. <laughs> she came a respectable 24th in her first event. She then came back for MCC 18 with the Green Greens. It was not her event by all means, but it is when she touched the top 10 for the first time, in to get to her side. I can fly, I got 9. Hey, 11! I got 14. I got really flying. And to give since 12 games compared to last time, yeah that's an improvement at the very least. MCC 19 saw some of her improvements from her good build mark to some spare kills in Sky Battle. And then came MCC 20 with two of the most competitive people in the event, Firebob and Anfrost, as well as H-Bomb himself. And they smashed the competition, from her contribution in team games to a solid to get to a side game for her, after the three events being not in her favor, despite the top 10 mentioned earlier. And the team won it, with strats and skills across the team. Oh, you no. get it, you get it, you get it, you get it, you get it. She got it, she got it, she got it. That's so stressful. That's so stressful. Oh god, I was so greedy. I was so greedy. We did it! Oh my god, I was so greedy. I was I'm so sorry. I was so greedy. I'm I'm a greedy little boy, I'm sorry. And with that, she quit. Well, not, no, I, I lied. She was benched for an event and then returned in MCC 22. This event has her being the top of the team in Meltdown, with well an elim from her, as well as improving in parkour attack in terms of her runs. She also improved in to get to the side, like the last event, and surprisingly, she's good at holding the wall. Really? Even though she hated the game? Really though? This proves that she has some improvements in her movement skills as the event goes on. But then MCC24 happened. This was the event where she was pushed to her limits in terms of new chemistry. It was not her event at all in terms of that. Despite her improved rocket speed brush time and in sense of time, she really does not fancy the team at all. What even just happened, chat? <laughs> I'm gonna need like... A Maybe. long while to process that. <laughs> I think we have anti comms. It's so interesting. I've never been on a team like that. <laughs> oh gosh. I feel like my run was solid. I just needed more rusty keys and I should not have been sent back in there. I was a giant waste of time and I knew it.
because there was no sand in there. I, I had just taken all of the sand out. I shouldn't have gone back in for a vault. I should have gone to deep into another path to get more sand. And I know that, but for some reason, I don't listen to me. Uh, this event made Jem take a break from the tournament due to how it went down in MCC 24. But then, she came back for MCC 28, three canon events after. And she really did well in games, from one of her top ace race runs to build this thing I showed you earlier. Run, bank, 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 bank. Oh my gosh, I do not know if I'm gonna make this. You've got it, you've got it, you've got it, you've got it. You make it, you make it, you make it. Just run, just run, you've got it, you've got it. You make it. No, the skeleton, the skeleton boost, the skeleton boost! Yes! 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 I was also really stressed watching this as well. Which really though, this proves that she can be a solid sense of time runner herself. Other than that, she participated in two other non-canon events, MCC Pride 22 with a very good build mod in their hands and them working like clockwork, and MCC Scuff with yet another good to get to the side from her, to something something sky block oh yes. I did nothing, I just stood there. Guys, I think we got to first from that. Jem can be underrated by some people in the event space, but when you take a closer look at her, she has desire to improve in skills necessary in the event. Her PP training in Hermitcraft contributed to her growth in PP, as shown in Scuff, and that she always tried to improve on her movement games dominantly in to get to the side. And team games wise, Sense of Time and Build Mart really are her jam. In given time, she can be as skillful as the likes of Joe Smarsh Beans or even Green, and enough time she can reach the top 10 out of 4 in an event. Jem really is great after all. This is the story of Gemini Tay.